Squad, what is going on? It's Stealth. We're back with another Minecraft video. Hope you guys are doing great. Today we're going to be doing a review slash first impressions on the Better Together. It's going to be sort of a mixture just because this is such a large update slash new version of Minecraft. You guys can call it whatever you want. Minecraft 2, Better Together, whatever. It's a new version of Minecraft essentially called Minecraft. And we're going to be looking at it and uh, from multiple angles for the most part because this is very complex and it had such a rough start which we will be talking about in today's video and just keep an open mind guys this is my review so it is my opinion I'm gonna just try and look at it at different angles and just try and be sort of objective at the same time open-minded so hopefully you guys do appreciate that if you can do me a quick favor leave a like on today's video it would just support the channel it's greatly appreciated subscribe guys click that subscribe button notifications on i will be replying to every single subscriber in today's video it's about to be lit bro so let's go ahead and check out the store um the cool thing about this version of minecraft in particular is that they're constantly updating it. They've already had over 3,000, probably close to 4,000 bug fixes by now, which is really cool. It's really wicked that they can just update this version of Minecraft pretty much instantly, which is just lightning quick, right? When it comes to bug fixes and glitches and anything that's related to the server, they can fix it pretty quickly. But depending on the size, it might have to go through the certification process. But still, it is really quick. So, as of right now, they don't have all the skin packs. They don't have all the texture packs or mashup packs. But they are uh, um, they are pretty much updating it pretty quickly. So, I'm not entirely sure what we're missing here. But I can tell you that we're missing my skin for sure. So, they haven't added some of the major skin packs and mashup packs and texture packs but I'm sure within the next few days, maybe the next few weeks, we will have the complete uh, catalog from the console edition in terms of DLC. So that's pretty exciting uh, that they are updating this with uh, console content as well as content from, uh, you know, Java and PC edition. So that's really, really exciting stuff. Um, but I uh, just wanted to show you guys what we have so far. They do have the Fallout mashup, which is pretty recent. Chinese mythology Halo is on here, which a really cool thing actually is that you can actually download the Halo. You can purchase the Halo on Pocket Edition, Windows 10, as well as Nintendo Switch, which is pretty crazy. I mean, having something like Halo on the Nintendo Switch is something I was not expecting. I don't think anybody was expecting that. So whenever the Nintendo Switch Edition does get this update, which we don't have an exact date yet, um, you guys will have access to the Halo mashup pack, which is, wow, being able to play as Master Chief on a Nintendo console? Like, are you guys serious? Like, this is just mind-blowing. So, exciting stuff. Um, but yeah, that's uh, basically what you can expect from the shop as of right now. Um, but let's go ahead and check out some of these settings really quick. And uh, it is a lot different, especially if you're coming from a console platform the xbox one console edition it is pretty different but luckily I, i've you know i've had a decent amount of time to look at all of this especially during my scrub to pro series and i know a lot of you guys have checked that out uh but let's go to let's just check out controller you can edit all of your settings which is a nice feature uh, that 4j studios initially brought to minecraft really really cool so you can customize all of that we got a profile right here um, we got video settings, which I love to play around with. Um, I will later, but I'm just trying to show you guys what you can expect. Uh, we got audio settings as well, and uh, I typically keep the music uh, down all the way to zero as a YouTuber thing, as a content creator thing. Um, but uh, we got global resources and uh, some really cool stuff. Like I said, I showcased all of the um, texture packs and mashup packs. We're still waiting on shaders, though. And that's something I'm just going to go ahead and take a, <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to subtract the point from the better together automatically for shaders because um, hopefully I can find the clip. But initially, I believe shaders were supposed to come out before the actual update. At least they were promoting it that way. Um, so I'm surprised that we don't have shaders yet by now. Um, I'm not going to hold it against anybody, but at the same time, that's how they marketed this version of Minecraft is supposed to have shaders and 
Xbox Live will unite the global Minecraft community across mobile, VR, Windows 10 PCs, and consoles. As part of this effort, we're excited to welcome player-made skins, maps, textures, and massive community-run servers into the game itself. Because we know that the amazing content you create makes Minecraft even better. This fall, Minecraft will receive a free 4K update that brings more graphical options to the game. But we didn't stop there. Yes, uh, let's go ahead and check out survival really quick. We'll just go ahead and just create a world. I don't have anything specific um, to transfer over as of right now. We do have realms, so that's pretty exciting. You will have to pay for that. Um, but let's just go ahead and create something brand new. And uh, we'll do it in creative as well. So we'll go to, uh, we don't want to go to create yet. We'll go to game settings and default will be creative and some cool things some really promising things now i know like console already has this but we will be getting custom super flats as well as amplified world settings so really cool um but as of right now we got peaceful easy normal hard i was hoping for ultra hard but uh, i guess we'll have to wait for that as well um but let's see what else we have infinite world we got old flat and i think that's about it now that's something i really do hope they improve on more world types i'm really not a fan of infinite um so you know what let's just go ahead and start a, a old world map setting so this is gonna be super duper small and here are some of the other settings pretty much uh basic stuff you guys all should recognize this if you have played Minecraft. Uh, just basic stuff right here. Nothing really too different in terms of customization. Uh, but let's go ahead and create this really quick. It should be on creative. And take a look at this world. Now, coordinates is something I don't know if they have actually updated it yet. Where it's a survival feature without turning off any of the trophies or achievements. But as of right now, I think it's still considered a cheat so coordinates are technically a cheat right now um for survival but you can still technically use them so that's pretty cool um but eventually they just need to make it a survival feature that does not have you know that doesn't take away anything period so just like console and uh I, you know at least they are open to the idea which i'm really excited for and i really do appreciate you know the way microsoft has handled this version of minecraft in that respect where they're willing to listen to the community and that's extremely important to me as a youtuber and as a gamer and a minecraft you know player that's really important that they're actually willing to listen to the community and add from people that really enjoy minecraft so that's a really good thing and that's a bonus so we're just gonna go ahead and say they made that point back <laughs> the point that i took away for shaders they made it back so Really happy about that. This is taking a long time to generate. Holy cow. We might have to go straight to servers or we're going to do a time skip. But I am surprised. This is infinite. But at the same time, like, yeah, they just... Actually, no, this isn't infinite. This is old world. This is old world setting. So I'm not sure why this is taking such a long time. But um, they probably have to generate a ton of blocks. But some other things that... Um, that uh, I initially felt about this update was how it was handled. I was not expecting this update to come out when it came out. In fact, I was hoping it wouldn't. I feel like they sort of rushed it. Now, this is sort of the part of the review where it's my opinion. Well, the whole review is my opinion, but the way they handled this, I felt like it could have been handled better. Not only how they released it in terms of, you know, some people had... Uh, were had to buy this game again some people actually spent twenty dollars buying minecraft again and that was a bug some people were directed to forza for some apparent reason when they were trying to download this update which keep in mind it's a free update if you own if you already own the console edition this should be a free update but the fact that some people actually were directed to forza a completely different game as well as some people a lot of people actually had to were directed to buy this version of Minecraft for $20, I think around $20. Uh, 
is, in my opinion, that is something that should never happen. Six months later. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna have to check out survival some other time, maybe in a separate video. Unfortunately, I had to quit Minecraft, rejoin, retry, and it took another 10 minutes. I don't know why it's taking so long, but hopefully they fix this within the next couple of hours or day or so. Um, so we'll just check out survival in a separate video. Um, but for now, let's go ahead and check out servers, which I've had a lot of gameplay, a lot of time to check out these servers, especially during the beta. So I know quite a bit about in PvP, Lifeboat, and Mindplex by now. Um, so we'll just review one of these servers, and we'll review the one that I've had the most difficulty with, which is Lifeboat. In terms of connection, lag issues, and just consistency, that's not to say I don't like Lifeboat. I honestly really enjoy all of these servers, but in terms of me being able to start a game and finish a game, Lifeboat is probably like one out of eight or nine games <laughs> I'm actually able to play. So I'm hoping just for a fun experience. That's what I'm going to be looking for is just having fun and just being able to start a game and finish a game without really too many issues. And I don't really think that's much to ask for, especially considering that Microsoft and Mojang and whoever else felt that it was, you know, good enough for them to release. So... Let's just go and uh, actually just start a game quick play. I really don't care what we play. I just want to have some fun, bro. Okay, is this gate still having some issues? Are we still having issues with this quick play? Because quick play... Oh, wait, never mind. Hey, there we go. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> is this survival games? I was not reading. I was not reading. Was this... This looks like survival games. It feels like survival games to me. I, I hope so. Because this... This looks lit, bro. What do we got? Game starts in a minute and 30 seconds? Are you for real right now? Are you for real? There's no way we could wait a minute and 30. 90 seconds? Are you for real? Oh, here we go. What's going on here? We, we got something going on, guys. I think we're in something else. I'm not, I'm not sure what's going on right now, but... Uh, oh, wow. This looks amazing. What are we doing right now? Can they tell me? Could, like, okay. Ninja someone joined the match. Okay, so... You know what? Okay, they're teleporting me again. I, I like this. Uh, I like this view, but uh, you know, I'm just fine with just staying in one one spot until the game starts. <laughs> Am I doing this by myself? I don't think I'm touching. I'm not touching anything. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh my gosh! Whoa! 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 What's happening? Are we starting? Are we starting right now, bro? Come on! No! 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 Are we? Why? What? 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 Bro, stop this. No. <laughs> I just want to play right now, bro. I just want to play. I just want to play. Four to six weeks later. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. So we didn't have any server or connection problems. We're just literally waiting as people join and back out. Like, literally they join and back out. So instead of just sending you to a server that's ready to start... They basically put you in this game and they cycle through all of these people until like maybe it's at a decent number and then they start the mini game, which I'm not too fond of. I think Lifeboat only does this because in PvP, they put you in a lobby and then they count down and when the countdown is over, you guys are just playing something. So I do like that. I do appreciate those type of lobbies more and uh, similar to like the console edition for battle mode and uh you know just glide you know once you start something the countdown goes it's just starting and i really appreciate those type of lobbies as you guys could see um i don't think we're actually gonna be able to play this because we've been here more than 90 seconds it's probably been about two or three minutes um since we have that time skip so yes i just don't think this is gonna happen so what we're gonna do is we're gonna save and quit we're going to go back into Lifeboat and we're just going to just jump into something without using the quick play feature. I've never really had too much too much success period with the quick play, so we're just going to leave that alone for now. Not going to judge the update based on quick play. Um, I think that's more of an issue with the independent servers and how they, I don't know, whatever's going on with the quick play. I feel like until they can have more consistency, they should probably just take away this function right here, quick play. Um, but for now, let's go ahead. Oh, oh my goodness. Let's just go ahead and check out. Let's see. We got survival mode. We got zombie apocalypse. We got prison. Ooh, prison. 
We got Skywars. A lot of people are playing Skywars over here. A thousand. You know what? That just seems easy enough. All right, let's go ahead and play some Skywars and um, see how this goes. I'm hoping that it just goes smoothly, and that's honestly all I want. You know, I just, <laughs> just want to be able to play something. I think everybody wants that. So uh, let's see how this goes. And uh, yeah, I'm just really hoping for success here, guys. But let me know down below in the comment section what is your favorite feature of the Better Together update. What are some things that you wish they could improve on before actually releasing this? And what do you think they should add in the future? Um, so here we are. Um, we have, we're in the lobby again. And we got quite a few people in there. We got BMAP. We got, let's see, we got running, whatever that is. We got this one, we can just join right now. And uh, I don't know, it looks like there's zero people in there. We can always try this quick play again. I feel like sometimes it works, sometimes, oftentimes it doesn't. <laughs> All right, here we are guys. So we're in a lobby. I honestly don't think we're gonna stay here. It's gonna just flip us around until we're in something. So very confusing especially if you're not used to this. It is very confusing. I don't still think I'm used to it, and I've been playing the better together for over three weeks now. So um, I think it's just going to keep on just teleporting us until we're in the lobby that we're supposed to be in. And I think this is it right here. I think we are touchdown. All right, it looks like people are joining pretty quickly, which I do like. This is how I want my mini games to start is just have a have the people that are trying to join get in right so are you ready oh here we go here we go guys here we go it's about to go down right, oh, oh wait 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 time out they're tricking us they're tricking us don't hype me up bro okay here we go oh three oh ho, ho. here we go two yes yes Woo! all right here we go go here we go okay so we got all kinds of blocks right now leave that chat alone we got more blocks Yes, yes, yes. We got some armor too. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh gosh. Nope, 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 nope. I'm running. I'm out of here, bro. I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. What are you what are you doing, man? What are you doing? Get get what 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 I'm trying to snowball him off. <laughs> trying to snowball you out of here. Are we are is this a team one? I don't feel like this is a team one. If this isn't a team one, he just hit me off. I'ma kill him. You're gonna be the first one to go, bro. Ooh, you're gonna be the first one to die. Should I get up there and smack him? All right, I see you, I see you. I'm gonna strafe. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, 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 woo, here we go. Squad, how'd you like that strafing, homie? How'd you like that strafing? All right, we're gonna go up there and we're gonna kill him next. We're gonna get you next, bro. My health is not, cl what is going on? All right. What's going on? <laughs> These blocks are super confusing. I don't think he sees me, but I'm hoping my health will climb up a little bit quicker before I engage in this battle. Should we, can we, can we sneak up on him? You guys think we can sneak up on this per uh, person? I think we can sneak up on him. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Gonna hit you off, Mike. Gonna hit you off, revenge. Get dark, get dark, die, die. <laughs> Let's do this. Yeah, yeah. Revenge is sweet. No, what? Okay, okay. Connection. Connection, bro. <laughs> oh, man. I'm a savage right now, though. Can we get inside there? Can we Can we break and enter? All right, let's destroy this. I actually, I'm curious what's inside there. Ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. All right, I see someone else. We should get some food going. I want a better sword, though. That's what I really want is a better sword. All right, let's see what can we get in here. We got some more. Oh, we got some arrows. You know, your boy stealth likes them arrows, though. All right, we're gonna go inside here. I see that. I see that guy. I think he's trying to get up here, though. So we gotta be careful. He's trying to get inside our base. He's trying to get inside our base. All right, come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Oh, we gotta break that too. All right, I'm getting lazy here, guys. I'm getting super lazy. Like, come on. All I wanna do is fight, fight, fight. Oh, I see you too, man. Oh, I'm gonna get him. Should we get him? Can we throw ball something? Ooh, ooh, we got a, ooh, we got an arrow. We got a bow. Guys, let's do this. We gotta hurry. Oh, too late. It's too late. All right, I see him. How many more people we got? I'm pretty sure I can kill that guy. I can kill him. 
I hope so. Whoa, 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 what just happened? What? I, I, whoa, what? What? No way, I died from that. How many blocks is that? How many blocks is that? Bro, one, two, three. Okay, I can't, this is just, this is really smooth. Like, how do you even tell? <laughs> Are you serious? Okay, we got three, three, seven, eight, eight blocks at most right there. I died from a, a oh my gosh, I can't believe that. <laughs> All right, well, man, I was confident I could have won that too. That's unfortunate, but uh, an L is an L, guys. And I, I will accept that L. But I've never died from that height before. I honestly have never died from that height. Uh, but uh, yeah, we'll try again some other time. So in terms of uh, servers, I have to say that uh, I, I re it's really hard to judge it just based off of that one game. I will say that it is a lot better <laughs> right now than it has been during the beta. So I can honestly say that much. Um, there were a couple of times where I was over here and I thought I was going to jump off. So hopefully they can fix that. It's like a little type of glitch where it's almost like a teleporting glitch where you think you're further than you actually are and often you can miss jump. Another thing I really hope is that, that, the, that they actually fixed is actually they did fix it. So during the beta, you couldn't really tell what type of weapon the person was holding. Um, often it would just be an invisible weapon. So I'm glad to see that they actually fixed that. So that's a really nice plus right there. Um, and besides that, yeah, I, I know if it's decent on Lifeboat, it's probably a lot better on Mindplex and in PvP. So I'm not too concerned about that, but let me know guys how your connection has been with the servers. I'm sure everybody's having probably similar experiences. I'm hoping so. Also, it depends on your internet as well, clearly, uh, but they should all be pretty consistent by now. But um, all right, let's go ahead and back out. I think, I don't know. I think we've seen pretty much enough of this update as of right now. We'll probably do a more in-depth update or review as time progresses, maybe like a week or two weeks from now when we have more content to go off of. But um, yeah, honestly, guys, I would like to give like a number like one through 10 or, you know, something like that. But I think we'll just do a letter grade. Honestly, just based off of how it was handled initially with the release of the Better Together and the fact that the Switch is not included, which they did market it that way. They did say that, you know, this was going to be released during fall. And the fact that they weren't able to keep that promise, which, you know, they broke a promise to a huge fan base, which is the Nintendo Switch people. Um, inclusion is a big part of this update, the Better Together. And I'm going to look at it that way. So the fact that the Switch isn't included um, is a huge negative, in my opinion. And, you know, I, I really wish that it could include more consoles, more versions, but I can't hold it against them. I know old technology is really hard to develop on, but the fact that the Nintendo Switch isn't included is a huge negative, in my opinion. So I'm just going to give this probably a B minus C plus range. Um, but let me know down below in the comment section. Like I said, guys, how do you feel about this update? Hopefully you enjoyed the review, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So take care. Peace.